What's up? This is Big E Raw TV, the sexy lady edition. And we want to address, you know, I want to address another topic that's been on my mind with the female species, ladies. I've been hearing y'all talk a lot of this stuff about you choose to be single in a world where God created man and woman and man for woman and woman for man. Why would you choose to be single, ladies? Uh, that, that makes no sense. That's an oxymoron. I think for some of y'all ladies, y'all realize that, you know, your goal of finding that quality man that you want is out of reach. And the older you get, the more you see, the lesser your chances are that you won't come across that quality man that you want. That, you know, six-figure nigga, you know, the six-foot-tall nigga. The six pack ab nigga. And then some of y'all ain't even, you know, you don't meet the qualifications to have a six figure, six pack, six foot, four, tall, dark, and handsome brother. You know, y'all think because your money and your, you know, CEO status gonna get you those things, but y'all don't realize that's not how we as men operate, baby. We don't care about your you know, materialistic possessions that you have. We care about your beauty, your youth, youthfulness, and your submissiveness and cooperation. That's what we want as black men out here. We want a beautiful, submissive, cooperative, cooperative woman. That is what we need, ladies. Y'all must be cooperative, you know, and you must stop telling yourself these things that I choose to be single. You don't choose to be single, baby. You just finally, as older you get, you come into the reality that, hey, this may not happen for me in life. So I better just prepare my mind that, hey, I'm probably going to be an old, lonely lady sitting around with the rest of my friends, you know, itching and bit itching about how many ish. You know, and not taking responsibility for the role you may have played in your own, you know, life and loneliness. Sometimes y'all talk yourself into loneliness, you know, by talking about, well, he ain't got this and he ain't got that. He don't make enough of this for me, so therefore, he ain't on your level and your status. But what you don't talk about is, you know, what's in this man's heart and his soul, you know. All of that seems to be, you know, don't get me wrong now, we all want somebody, you know, you don't want to carry nobody through life. You don't want no bum ass nigga. We all know that. But, you know, sometimes y'all price yourself out of love. That's what you do, sweetheart. You price yourself out of love. That's why you're not going to find no real true love. You ain't going to find nobody who really truly care about you. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, ladies, y'all got to stop this, this way y'all come across with that, you know, all these slick sayings y'all got, you know, to really hide and mask the pain that you feel. That's all that is, ladies, y'all hiding and masking pain, sweetheart, you know, y'all try to triumph from, you know, make these triumph from say-sos, you know, the little, you know, sayings y'all have. And it's all just pain. And the brothers, we can see that. We could tell, sweetheart, you in pain. All right, you trying to mask the pain that you feel that, you know, life ain't going the way you thought it was. And you, you not going to have a white picket fence and, you know, the marriage and the horse and the baby carriage and ride off into the sunset with the, you know, tall, dark, handsome, you know, savior. He ain't here to save you. And then sometimes you do it to yourself with the mouthpiece. You know, submissiveness, sweetheart, submissiveness and sweetness will get you a long way. And stop with these, you know, sayings y'all have to try to, you know, show some strength there where there's really, you know, weakness and sadness. Come on over to Big E Therapy. I got you, baby. I got a lot of issues. I got a lot of tissues for your issues. Come on, Big E, Raw TV. You know, hit the subscription, 
you know, if you like this, you know, hit the like button. You know, I'm trying to come up in the world. I right, help Big E come up in the world. And, you know, I'll give y'all some therapy sessions, you know. Big E, the Black Dr. Phil therapy sessions coming to a theater near you. You know, I want you to pay your, you know, ticket to get in a movie theater. And Big E going, you know, give you all the therapy you need to get you through this, you know, these hard times. You know, we don't want you to lose your mind and end up in a straight jacket, ladies. You know, that's where some of y'all headed, the straight jacket, straight jacket heaven. And I don't, Big E don't want to see you there. So when you need that therapy, I'm your man. Come see me. Big E Raw TV, a.k.a. the Black Hannibal Lecter, the Big Green Monster, a.k.a. Verbally Vicious, a multi-talented. All right? I get things done. So when you need that therapy and you need that help, don't deny it. Get out of that river called denial. You're in the river called denial, sweetheart. Come to Big E, put on your track shoes, and come running for that therapy, baby. You need it. Time is running out. You know, you don't want to pop whatever brain cells you got left. Peace.